Today we're going to learn how to thread and insert a bobbin on a Husqvarna Viking 6020. It's a vintage sewing machine. So we start off with the um, thread. Please remember to always use decent thread, otherwise you'll have very variable results. So it goes on to either one of these spool pins. They are, as you possibly know by now, for using two threads at the same time through two different needles. Well, actually, you can put two different threads through one needle if you want to. Then we come to this hook here. And we just go underneath that hook. And I am now going to try and turn you so that you can see this part of the machine a little better. We now take the thread between the discs here, which is the tension discs. So take that between those two discs there. Through these two discs here. All right, that's where your thread goes next. And then it comes down and up. So it goes down the left side of this, goes up the right side. From there, we're going to thread this machine. Doesn't have the split at the top of this thread take up. So it goes through the hole and then down to this little pigtail and it goes around the pigtail and then behind here on the just above the needle at this point i put the presser foot down so that the uh, tension discs up here hold the yarn and stop it from pulling through and then you thread your needle from front to back all right, let's see. In this light, sadly, I can't see very well. My apologies for taking this long. If I'd put the light on, it might have made a bit of a difference. Yeah, make sure you haven't, like this one, got the thread knotted around the hook. So your thread goes through the needle from front through to the back. So now you can once again lift your presser foot and your thread can go through the presser foot, the gap there, and out the back. And next we're going to thread your bobbin. So here's the bobbin for this machine. I like to help people by saying, pretend you're putting it into the bobbin and hold it like that. Then you take your bobbin, which has been properly wound. Check that it's not spongy when you push your nail into it. If it's soft and bouncy, that's the tension is completely wrong on your winder. And you need to rewind it on a better um, tension, but that's another story. So now you take your bobbin and it's going to be in a P shape with your thread hanging down the left side of the bobbin, like that, it looks like a P, and you hold your case the way it's gonna go into the machine, and you engage the bobbin with the bobbin case, like that. You then take the thread, and you're gonna pull it through the little gap over there, and underneath this tension spring here and it'll click when it's through there. You're now ready to insert it in the machine. So you just continue to hold it like that and you press it into the machine. The little post on your bobbin, I'll take that out and show you again. This little post has a little gap in there where that gap is and that is how you push it in. So. That's how it goes in, post up into that little gap there. Now you take your top yarn thread and using your hand wheel, you turn it towards you very slowly, just very gently holding onto this thread and it'll pull the bobbin thread to the top. And then you push them both to the back. You are now ready to sew.
So that is how you thread a 6000 series, a 6020 in this case, Husqvarna Viking sewing machine.